This is so close to the radar site that it's uh, giving you a pretty good indication of where the winds are in the lower, let's say, 500 to 1,000 feet in the atmosphere. And this darker shade of blue right in through here, which is working up through Bertie County now and heading up toward, let's say, uh, Gates and also Perkimans and Chowan counties, is uh, anywhere from 50 to 60 mile per hour winds. And even on the back side of this, some stronger winds. So keep an eye on this. It can produce wind damage, as I mentioned, already reports of some uh, trees and power lines down as we took you back toward uh, Rocky Mount with the gusty winds that they had there. Here's just a close-up of this radial velocity. What amazes me is this looks like it's developing a very clear-cut and defined center. You can see the strong core winds on this band of convection east of the center and also to the west and northwest. So it's on its way to developing, even over land. And we think that once it gets over the waters, it even has a better chance to do so. So if you live around the Chesapeake Bay, if you live south toward Elizabeth City, North Carolina, and the northern part of uh, North Carolina, keep an eye out, especially around Corolla and up toward the Mackay uh, Island National Wildlife Refuge. Looks like a pretty busy uh, afternoon with gusty winds coming your way. Now what's interesting as we look at the water vapor is we actually see in this darker shade a trough of low pressure which is beginning to develop. Now that's going to take these winds in a little bit more of a southerly direction and potentially take Danny and what it becomes up toward eastern Long Island or even the Cape in the islands. So this is something to watch as we go through the next 36 to perhaps 40 hours as the computer models are already picking up on this and obviously the potential here is for some regeneration over the warmer waters. So we're not through with Danny and we uh, obviously have a pretty good look at what's going on. We just got word that the Hurricane Center is uh, dove right into this and they're keeping an eye on it. If they do reissue this as a tropical system, it will be Danny. Danny once again. So we'll let you know as, uh, as conditions warrant and we'll get a word from the Hurricane Center, I would imagine, as to whether they're going to do this or not once it moves back over water later on this afternoon. With more details on the rest of the nation's weather and a look